What's going on peeps and welcome to the channel. I really appreciate you checking out this video. Today's video will cover a comic book character that MCU fans have been anxiously waiting for his arrival into the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Many are expecting an official Nova announcement at D23 in September. So let's jump right into the video and find out who is Nova. His true name is Richard Ryder. Richard was just an average high school student going through all of the things a typical teen experiences. He did have a bit of an inferiority complex, and it didn't help matters that his younger brother Robert was practically a scientific genius, and the school star athlete had an affinity for harassing Richard. Meanwhile, out in space, a Nova Corps member from the planet Xandar had pursued the warlord Zor to Earth. Zor had recently seemingly destroyed Xandar. The Nova Corps member, Roman Day, had superpowers granted to him by the Nova Force, but Day was dying from the wounds he had received fighting Zor. He knew he didn't have long before he would succumb to his injuries and made the call to pass on his powers and equipment to a worthy successor. He fired out a beam of energy that would seek out that successor. The beam struck Richard Ryder, who was hanging out at the local teen hangout, Uncle Fudge's Ice Cream Parlor. The beam left Richard comatose and he ended up in the hospital. The doctors were puzzled and couldn't figure out why he was comatose. While he was in his coma, he was mentally fed information about his predecessor, Roman Day, his new powers, and Zor. Richard eventually snapped out of his coma and brushed off the information as a dream. It wasn't long before Richard realized it wasn't a dream and he did in fact have superpowers. As Nova, Richard can channel the Nova Force, giving him superhuman strength and durability fly up to warp speed. He also has enhanced recuperative abilities. He can generate energy, which he can use in multiple ways, most commonly energy blast and pulses. He also has access to the Xandarian world mine, which contains all of the collective knowledge of the Xandarian peoples. Richard didn't care for the official title of Centurion Nova Prime, feeling it was much too long, so he shortened it to just Nova. He quickly became a known hero in New York, battling villains like Condor, The Corrupter, Sandman, and many others. Before he knew it, he was befriending and working alongside heroes such as The Thing, Daredevil, and Spider-Man. At one point, he assisted S.H.I.E.L.D. for a while. He then joined the Defenders, but quit the very next day. Eventually, his double life began to affect him. He was barely passing his classes, and he was estranging his family. He ended up sharing his secret with his parents and his brother, who were surprisingly supportive. Nova has gone on to be a member of other superhero teams like the New Warriors, Champions, and the reestablished Nova Corps. So when do you think we'll see Nova in the MCU? Will he get his own movie, Disney Plus show, or show up somewhere else? Let me know where you think he'll show up in the MCU down in the comments. As always, I appreciate you taking the time out of your busy day to stop by the channel and check out these videos. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you again real soon. Ahala. Peace.